Hey guys, what's up? Wally with Beach River Landscapes here. And today we are picking up our new mower. So we're buying a new mower. Um, we're gonna demo it first, um, you know, and then we're gonna buy it. But we've already decided we're buying it. So that's why we're demoing the one that we wanna buy. So we're gonna get a Pro Stance um, 60 inch deck. Um, and we're getting it with the Kohler 25 horsepower EFI and we are getting it with a mulch kit put in it. So they got that set up Saturday. We're here um, today to pick it up. Um, so real quick, I, I do want to start off by saying that as an ambassador, it's, it's awesome what I saw happen with a particular situation that I was in. So Gravely, I started off with a Gravely. First mower I ever owned was Gravely and I loved it. It was a tank. I loved the way it cut. Everything was great. The dealer took the taste of it right out of my mouth, just like it does with a lot of other things. So I moved on. I went to Lesco and then, and then other things. Um, so what I ended up doing was, at many years later, obviously, uh, meeting the folks at Gravely, being able to talk to them, um, tell them my concerns. Um, you know, Jacksonville's such a huge market, and I just felt like they were missing out. It's such a great machine. Um, so, long story short, they ended up reaching, you know, reaching through the whole, I don't know how they do it, I don't know. But anyways, they ended up moving the entire Gravely deal out of one dealer into another. I used to come to Tools for Time back in the day. Um, I don't like X Mart, it's where I bought my first X Marks from here. So I haven't been back out here in many, many years. So they were awesome to move this out here. I think that was a great move for them in Jacksonville here in particular. So Tools for a Time is where I'm at. Gravely is now here and now I'm back at Tools for a Time and I'm really stoked. Um, so what I want to show you guys though is pretty unique about tools for time if you're not in the area um, it's worth driving up here if your dealers don't do this but I want to show you something that they do that's that's pretty awesome so the the niche the, the niche for tools for time is is this so let me get behind the camera they do they do full trailer setups here um, obviously these don't have you know everything on them they don't have the sticks on them but I want to show you guys they sell packages out here so they already come you know with the standard racks and everything which work great you know all these like uh which now they have blower racks and everything which is cool so they have all of this stuff just comes you know prefab welded everything's on the trailer you get a pretty good decent trailer <clears throat> and it comes with a mower you can build your package so they sell they sell echo and and all that here so you can you know build your package you know all the sticks there blowers everything pick which motors you want pick which size trailer you want um, and you're good to go that's what's really cool about what they do out here selling the entire package um, so that's something unique and that's what draws a lot of people here so they're carrying the atlases out here as well um, they've got everything from commercial grade um, down to the homeowner grade which you know they're still really tough tough you know mowers <clears throat> you kind of barely call them home on the grade you know what i mean uh, but they carry just everything out here so it's like a one-stop shop to set everything up and to get busy so that's what i really love about this place um, like i said my first setup my first professional big setup came from this place right here so and it's um if you're familiar with jacksonville but you've never been here it's off of old saint augustine road and they carry X mark down at the end, uh, but you can just see all the Gravely lined up everywhere. And they got the twill action going on over here. So it's really awesome, man. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hop in here, go check with uh, Brendan, see if he's here. I have to get a couple things fixed. Since they carry Echo products, I, I need to get the, um, I need to get the, Shindawa and the Echo, I need new heads and everything. Um, somebody took uh, somebody took some stuff apart. I need to get some parts while I'm here. So I'm going to jump in there, get this going, um, grab the mower, and we're going to get going. All right, guys, so we're going to walk into Tools for a Time. I'm going to show you what it's like inside of the place also. Let's go in here. Bada boom, let me lighten this up. And this right here is the man. This is Brendan. Brendan. Right 
Brendan. See, it's all, yeah, don't, don't don't call me Brandon. That's rough. It's Brendan. Well, my daughter's name is Brennan, so people are always calling her Brendan all the time. So your name doesn't go anywhere. It's in my house. <laughs> Every time I like check her in somewhere, they're like, "Oh, Brendan." I'm like, "No, Brennan, Brennan, Brennan. no D." So I just want to show you guys this. Like, this is um, definitely the most impressive setup I've ever seen inside of a of a store. Um, I don't really like to call it a store. It's more like a shop that sells stuff. So. Um, you can see they got Honda stuff. They've got, you know, Shindawa, Echo. Um, you know, if you want steel, you don't come here. But if you want some really sick mowers, then you come here. So this is something I haven't seen yet right here. I haven't seen this before. I've never seen that. You guys seen this? 58 volt. Oh, this is a battery powered, battery powered push mower. Huh, interesting. So anyways, as you can see, this is pretty, wish I had a wider angle lens on here to get it all, but this is pretty awesome though. So I mean, they got trailers, you know, hanging from the ceiling. This is pretty dope though. I'll show you guys everything. That's a crazy looking X mark right there. Money! Anyways, generators, like all kinds of stuff in here. So, I mean, the display is pretty awesome. You know what I mean? This is what you got right here. Um, blowers, the whole thing, man. Like I said, I know you, a lot of you guys love Xmark, man. I just, I'm not an Xmark guy. They make great stuff, great equipment, just like everybody else. And there's just a thing, there's a thing that we all like and a thing that we all do not like. So this place really niches on complete setups, you know, like they're, they're equipped, they're equipped to like run everything on a brand new setup. And I think that that's, that's really cool to do that. It's definitely the only dealer like in town that does it this way. Um, and they pretty much have everything here. They have awesome staff. Um, they've got a, you know, just a, they've got an awesome staff, man. They've, they've got everything going on here. So it definitely feels like the ultimate, like one-stop shop. But anyways, they have some, you know, pretty good sized trailers here. Sink like some 12s and some 14s. This is definitely the place to go, man. It's a really killer place. Let me check, let you guys check it out one more time. All right, I'm gonna go get my mower now. Yeah, so a lot of what we do is turnkey business packages so somebody can come in not knowing anything about the industry, not having any equipment, and we'll set up everything for them. We've got the mower, trailer, all the handheld equipment with both Echo and Shindaiwa. They can go open trailer, enclosed trailer, and get everything on one low monthly price. We also do uniform shirts. We do marketing materials. If they want to do graphics on their truck and look cool like Beach River Landscapes, oh, we can help them out with that too. When did you guys start doing that? Years ago, uh, going back. Is that uh, long it's been since I've been in here? It's been, it's been a while. It's been a while, but uh, yeah, probably um, at least as long as we've been in here, so 2007. Um, it's one of those things, you know, people come in, they've, you know, they have a limited budget, and we try to get everything on one low monthly payment, let them finance everything, roll it in together, so their whole business startup costs are, are all on one. Package like this, you can do for, you know, $175 a month. So, 175 bucks a month, kind of, Scenario style, what does that get you? Uh, everything that you're looking at here. So uh, this is a Gravely 44 HD, which is an awesome mower, getting a lot of bad gates. Um, I'd still supplement it probably with a 21 inch uh, walk behind if you got a really tight spot, but uh, backpack blower, weed eater, edger, hedge trimmer, your trailer. Dang! That's pretty killer, man, because I pay like twice that a month just for one mower. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah you can. Awesome. You can. Yeah, so as far as startup costs, it's not bad. And I mean, you know, how many yards is that to cover $175? Oh, yeah, I mean, that's, yeah, that's nothing, man. So two yards and you're, you're already making money. So that's killer, though. So it's I was telling that's more or less your niche is complete packages. It, it is, you know, and, and I think people get a conception that all we do is startups. Obviously we cater to bigger landscapes, oh, yeah. uh, you know, like yourself, if you need to, to buy a mower, because we carry all the way up to, you know, the Xmark 96 right. HD. Yeah, I showed them that. But I mean, you know, a lot of, a lot of vendors cater to, you know, almost anybody, but not everybody has, I think, you know, and it's not to nail you down to it, because you don't get nailed down to one thing that you do because that's not it but what you do above and beyond most people especially anybody here that's true is this complete package deal so that's true i um, think we put a lot more effort into the business startup than any other dealership yeah it's 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 off the chain man so the first time i ever came in here i was blown away by it 
I mean, I remember when I came in here, I bought like a full X mark setup and a bunch of stuff. Like I already had the trailers, but um, I had some beaten down, broken trailer and the mowers were like so nice. I didn't even want to put them in the trailer, but you know. That's all right, they don't yeah. stay nice, you know. Yeah, so what size trailers do you do? Uh, the common size is five by 10, um, then we go up to a six by 12. Um, I can special order about any size trailer, but mostly uh, what people are getting are five by 10s or six by 12s. In the enclosed trailer, uh, six by 12, I keep in stock. Um, I can get seven by 14 tandems. Uh, so if somebody wants a seven by 16 V nose, I can get it. So pretty, you can get anything when it comes to trailers. Yep. All right, cool. Yep. I mean, you, get, you usually have to order trailers no matter where you go anyway. They don't that, have it on the lot, you're ordering That's it true, I've got a really good manufacturer with a short lead time. Uh, I can usually have a trailer within a week. So. Nice, nice man. All right guys, so he explained it way better than I did. So you may not even hear my explanation. I may just completely cut that out and just go to Brendan. Um, so I'm really excited that Gravely actually moved. I was telling him how they were at another place. Don't naysay people out loud, but sure. they were at another place and it just, I had never went back in there again. I'm not an Xmart guy, so I hadn't been back in here. So they actually took all that consideration and reached out to them and moved their entire dealership over here. So I'm just really stoked that they took it over. Um, you guys can just see how kind of like grand this place is. It's just really off the chain service, everything. It's, it's like I said, it's like a total one stop shop here. So I want to get my mower now, man. We'll get it. All Let's right. Bye bye. Right, guys so I'm out of here um, you guys let me know if you're picking up any new equipment this year what you're getting um, if you do have a gravely and you just got one or you've had one if you have a gravely what's the longest you've had it what's the amount of hours that you have on one what are your likes and what are your dislikes on the gravelies no matter what kind of gravely it is so I'd like to know that and I'll pass it on to them you can pass it on to gravely just tag them and all that they read as much as they can um, but let me know if you have a gravely how many hours are on it? I'm curious. Um, and what you guys think. What's your favorite mower? If it's not a Gravely, what is it? What's your favorite brand of mower? Um, I'm really excited to try that uh, 60 inch uh, you know, stand on, um, pro stance on our big properties. Um, the guys have just been saying that they really would like a stand up. I've always done sit downs um, besides the 36 inch walk behinds or V ride or, or you know, stand on. So being able to do a big 60 inch mower. Um, I think the guys are really gonna like it. I think it's gonna be better on our backs. So um, anyways, you guys leave a comment below. Let me know some stuff. And uh, yeah, on to the next one.